Hey YouTube, what's going on? Uh, Battle 909 back with another commentary on another custom zombie map. This time we're doing Karaishu. So stick back, relax, and enjoy the gameplay. After the explosion for the first two kills. Uh, the reason why I like this map, I mean, obviously it's another good map on YouTube that people talked or made videos about or whatever the case may be, but I think this map is awesome. This time I'm going for the Carbine. I've always gone for the Riska. This time I'm going for the Carbine. I want to change things up a little bit. Cool thing about this map I like, there's only one window here. So, playing by yourself, no problem. Just stand at this window. If you have four people in this map with Carbines, I'm pretty sure you can hold out here for a really good long time. Stop moving. I always like the carbine. There's just the first map, put it in there. More of a bolt action rifle guy, but I just wanted to change things up a little bit and use something different. Uh, okay, so that's round two. Uh, pretty much, I've been, if you haven't checked out my other videos yet, go check them out. Uh, pretty much, I made. Um, a bunch, lately I made a bunch of Left 4 Dead 2 hey, series videos, shot. and I also made a couple oh, of shit. custom I zombie levels, such as this one, week. I hope, once I make it, if I survive for a long time. A lot a I'm not, I really don't like putting up videos, unless I survive to level 15, unless it was like Desert Shack. Desert Shack only had one room, and there was like three guns, and you had to defend yourself. So that was that was why I only put that video in mine or whatever. The other one I survived to like 15 or 17 or something like that, so I put it on there. But I know this map pretty well. It's just like it's getting killed by stupid reasons like dogs or whatever. This is a whole this map is a whole Shinonuma style map. Has all the all the bells and whistles like uh, the dogs and. The zip line, the random perks that spawn in random rooms, you know, like you walk in the room, it's a random perk, instead of there's no power or anything. Also, there's an lags quite a bit. Um, so, well, obviously, for me to record it, it probably does, but if you play it by yourself without recording it, I don't think it will. There's been times I've lagged pretty hard in this game. On well, this map. Just a snap, not the, really the game, but this computer usually can handle it pretty well. Another day of kicking ass. Got a nice sum of points going. Got one mag left. Oh man. Shit! Weapons out of juice! I'm trying to stab this dude. Can't stab him. There we go. Alright, what I'm gonna do now. I have no ammo, but I'm gonna go this way. Come on. Here we go. Damn. I don't believe it's dogs. Uh, ah shit, don't tell me they just spawn in here. Like yep, ah. Uh. Juggernaut. Juggernaut, yes, thank you. If I survived this round, I could get it. Loading. Trent's gun is such a beast at taking out the dogs. Oh, crap, shouldn't have did that. Yes, there we go. Epic. And I didn't have to pay for ammo for the carbine, yeah, that's beast. That's right. Alright, finally, I made it past the dog round. Um, the last couple times I played, I played this map a lot, trying to make a video for you guys, so... But the last couple times I've died, I never... First of all, Jug finally spawned in this the first room I opened, finally. It's taken like forever for that point, it always spawned like speed cola. So now all I'm gonna do is just get enough points to buy it. That's all I want right now is just to get enough points. 
There we go. No oh, points I can buy it now. Beast. I wish I could meet the chick who sang that jingle. That's better. No, oh, and I got a little defense now because I got jug. Ah. Just don't like standing over there because it's like a two-way death, two-lane death trap. I don't know if I killed that guy or not. I'm just gonna stand over here. I like standing over here because the zombies have to, they always walk like over there and then they, they come up the stairs here. Insta kill, there we go. Alright, put a 10. No dice, freak sacks. You lose. Gonna play like two rounds or something, get you guys enough points so I can go to the mystery box or whatever. Um, zombie. Alright. Round six is over. Really the major step when you're playing solo is just getting past that dog round. I mean, that's what really the killers are. The dogs are really are what the killers are unless you have like a shotgun. So, it's really nice though. get past this round. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> oh jeez, yeah, I better stand back over here. Even though I have Jug, that doesn't guarantee me, like, safe haven. Or anything. So, I'm just gonna stand, like, over here and take these guys out. Notice how it's, you can see, if you, I don't know if you guys can see, it's lagging, but it's, on my screen, it's lagging. Slap me again, freak bag. Just blow your arm off. Blow a hole in your chest. Look at that mess I just made. Ooh, cook a frag. Not really even cook a frag. Just throw a frag. Alright, so that means I must have got some hits there. I'm trying to save a crawler. No, not you. That's good enough. That guy's good. Oh, there's double points out there. Oh god. I keep forgetting I have Jug on and I can take a hit or two. I don't have to be like slaughtered against the wall, but... Let's go get some points from the windows then. Alright. I got a, I got plenty of points now, so I'm gonna... See, I mean, <laughs> see how, fast I, <laughs> how fast it's walking? It's like, alright, you know you can't walk that fast. Come on. No, you can't. And... Let's go this way. I'm gonna go... Open this door now. Alright, see what's out here. Alright, so we got a bar on the wall. I know, oh, zombies spawn. It's just like Shino know we open a new area, the zombies decide to come out and play with you again. Try to kill you. Just stay up here. So I find one. There he is. Okay. Zip line is from there. Oh, by the way, the switch for the zip line is right here. Slide and ride. Sweet. Okay. Got a window over there. I like this back alley here. This is kind of nice because there's no windows and they can't climb over any walls or anything. So it's kind of like a you know. For a multi-person strategy, that probably would be the best area to stand, just because of the fact that there's no way they can get in or out besides the two ways. I'm just looking around here. Window. This is also, I think, a nice spot to stand, because there's w one single fire line, and you can just shoot them as they come down the hallway, so... Obviously, you need a superior, a good amount of firepower to do it, but... You know, stairs are blocked. Another area, like, right here dead end, but good firepower position. And then you got this door here, 750. And it is Speakola, alright. Type 100 on the wall. Another defensive barrier here. It's kind of cool. Don't have to die. 
dying is always really not the funnest thing, especially when you're playing zombies and trying to make it to a high level. So I'm just showing you guys the map. Uh, I'm going to pause the video right here because actually I don't know exactly how long this video actually is. So I'll see you guys in the next part.